Hey YouTubers, it is Tony with Mayberry Mini Trucks and we have a mini truck that we recently imported from Japan. It is a Mitsubishi Mini Cab. And this truck is a 1993. It is four wheel drive. It is $6,000. It has 37,367 miles. It's a really nice um, mini truck. It um, runs beautifully. Let me go ahead and do the walk around here. You can see that the mud flap, the tires look good. Has a good spare tire under there. And let's go ahead and go down the side here, why don't we? Um, you can see the side looks to be very straight. And here's the other mud flap behind the right front wheel. And here's the door. Just a little scrape there. That's not any rust damage. These drip guards are nice when it's raining. It helps you be able to crack the window and have fresh air when it's raining but not get wet and here's the front bumper the front end of the truck a little dirty maybe um, but not really um, I mean very straight it's very straight I guess is what I'm trying to say Again, this is just uh, surface rust. This is not like damage. It doesn't affect the operation of the truck at all. And here's the side door or the passenger door. No dings at all. That is a perfect door. So this truck really is in good shape. Uh, the interior uh, I think the seats might have a little bit of blemishes, but um, I think somebody <clears throat> burnt the seat in a couple of, sp or a few spots. Smoking is very popular in Japan. A lot of people don't realize that. So um, sometimes you'll have a cigarette burn or several. This has chains to hold your tailgate. And um, these are little pieces of rubber that were original on the truck. And they help keep the chain quiet when you're driving. And I tell people, get a piece of garden hose and cut two five inch long pieces and just put them on here. You know, take off the old one. And that keeps the chains really quiet. Um, here is a shot of the interior of the bed. Again, it has surface rust, but no damage uh, at all. I mean, it's a little, you know, it shows some signs of use in terms of having stuff in the bed, but not abuse. is tight the latches are very tight on this truck usually they're a little loose but um, they are adjustable so if they ever do get a little wobbly on you you can loosen the nuts the two 10 millimeter nuts and slide that latch all of our trucks are fully serviced we use full synthetic engine oil and this bed by the way is six feet long here's a shot of the door panel Very clean. And here are the seats in the truck. Um, this is really just rubbed. It's not rubbed through, but the fuzz on the seats rubbed off there. There's these little burn marks here and there on the passenger seat. Again, 
not going to probably ever get any worse, but that's what you got on the seats. And here is your door panel. The dashboard. The instrument cluster. And the floor. Really nice mats in this truck, by the way. They're almost like weather tech in terms of their design because the mud from your shoes is uh, contained in almost a sort of a pan. Okay, let's take it for a drive. Now, if you see a light on the dash, it's the seatbelt light. The truck is in two wheel drive. You wanna make sure that you're in two wheel drive when you're on the road. This truck turns a very tight turn radius. Another nice thing about the four wheel drive on this truck is you can just go in and out of four wheel drive with the push of a button. You don't have to do anything but push a button um, on the console. There's the button I'm talking about right there. All right, now we're gonna turn around. Very tight turn radius. This truck has excellent power. It's having no problem climbing up this hill. We're now in fourth gear and we are climbing speed, which I think is a great sign. This truck has incredible power, guys. It's really a super truck. It's tight. There's no rattles. Um, it runs perfectly. And, you know, Mitsubishi, they know what they're doing. They, there's no surprise there that the thing um, runs well. And of course, pays to take it out of gear before you let, let go of the clutch. All right, so um, if you're interested in this truck, let us know. Um, you can reach us by telephone at 336-337-5725. You can also reach us at mayberryminitrucks at gmail.com. Or you can check it out on our website at mayberryminitrucks.com. Thanks for watching our video and have a nice day.